Hi and welcome to this edition of Out of the Box. My name is Paul. Today we're going to have a look at what is in this brown box. It's another one of the Ubiquiti OCD panels and this is the brush panel which we'll have a look at in a moment. So what do you get in the box? We start off with a really exciting uh, get started guide, the smallest barcode or QR code you're going to see. Um, you do though get two rack mount ears. We'll show you how those fit in a minute. This is a 1U uh, plate, a blanking plate. Um, that you can push the cables through because of the brushes. So I'll show you how those fit in a moment. You're going to get the rack screws and uh, nuts there to be able to uh, mount that into your rack. And that's what you get in the box. Here's the panel itself, which is probably what you're more interested in. Uh, let me just see if I can hold that up there um, for you to be able to have a good look at. Um, let me just hold the side in place for you. Um, probably the back so you can see there as well and let's just um, probably this way around so you can see a little bit more. All right, so what is this? It's a 1U blanking plate for your rack uh, in Ubiquiti colors. If I reach here and grab carefully an Ethernet cable, um, what's the idea? The idea is that if you haven't maybe got a nice patch panel or you've got a whole bunch of cables coming in, um, that we can take our cable from the inside of our rack and just pop it through here um, and then uh, tidy it and connect it into our um, switch or our UDM Pro or whatever we might be connecting that into. Um, so it's a nice way of tidying up your rack when you haven't maybe got a patch panel, the options for a patch panel. Um, like I said, there are a number of ways, um, as you can see here on the end, uh, where the holes are cut. We do have a standard four holes on here and it will depend obviously on how your rack is set up. So we can do this flush mounted as you can see. Um, some people because of the way the rack the mounts, the, um, the front poles are set, um, that you need to set it back a little bit as well. So there are a couple of options there that you can do to make that fit as you need into the rack. But hopefully that's useful, really simple. Head on over to our YouTube channel, loads more box openings on wireless networking and firewalling devices. Um, so do subscribe and stay up to date.